Hi guys, uh, today I will be showing you um, on how to do a firmware upgrade on your iNew uh, V3 uh, phone. So I bought this phone uh, a few weeks ago and I uh, received it with uh, uh, firmware um, 101. I already done a, a, a firmware upgrade. Uh, the last version I had was uh, firmware version uh, 1.0.3. You can uh, see it here. And today I'm going to do the upgrade uh, for version uh, 1.04. And I will be using the SP Flash uh, modus. So uh, this is quite easy to do. Uh, first of all, make sure your uh, telephone is empty. So uh, make a backup of it and uh, make sure that you uh, clear the cache and clear uh, uh, do a factory data reset. So the phone is uh, totally empty because you will be uh, the new ROM will be uh, going uh, over the old ROM. So first of all, you need like. A few items, uh, a few tools. You need the SP Flash tool. That's this one over here. Um, I will be putting uh, the links uh, underneath the comment section, so you can download uh, straight from there. And you also need the new ROM. So I will be using the 1.0.4, so the newest ROM. Um, first of all, make sure you open the SP Flash tool. So when you open the folder, go to Flash Tool, right click and open as administrator. Uh, you can see now uh, the tool is uh, loaded. Uh, the only thing you have to do is uh, press scatter loading and get the correct file, the correct scatter file. This is a, a, a text document, so go to the file. Um, let's see where I put it here and it should be this one so this is the new scatter file I loaded it um, make sure you click this and put it on firmware upgrade and after that you can uh, press download so when you have done that um, just put your battery back in your iNew phone like that connect the USB cable to your uh, phone like this and do a reboot pressing the power up button like this and the volume bed button together and now you can see the flash is running. I will uh, zoom out a little bit, like this. So when you do it correctly, you can see the download is running here. So let it run. Wait a few minutes, and after uh, the download is done, uh, the phone will uh, reboot with your new ROM. So let's see how that uh, goes. <coughs> It's quite a fast uh, install. You can see it's uh, already on uh, 40 percent. And when it's finished, it will uh, the bar will turn uh, green, and you will get an OK sign uh, here. almost done just 20% uh, left here we go the last 10% Mm -hmm. 
and there you have it you get the green pop-up so it's okay your iNew phone uh, will be rebooting as you can see it's re rebooting now so you can go ahead and click this away just turn it off you can take out your cable and wait for your iNew phone to reboot <coughs> and let's see if uh, the new ROM is installed the first time it takes a while for the phone to reboot and there you have it, it's done let's see we go to settings let's see here let's see the settings here about phone and now you can see it's running the new 1.0.4 version and also the kernel version is updated so that's it it's quite easy to do put a new flash ROM uh, on your uh, iNew v3 phone uh, I will be putting uh, the newest version so the version 4 and I will also be putting the um, 1.0.3 version this is the uh, uh, rooted uh, ROM so go ahead and download anyone you like if I get the new version with root, I will uh, I will put it uh, also uh, underneath the comment section. Uh, especially thanks to the guys from uh, China Phone Area, uh, that is where I got uh, the ROM from. So thanks, guys, uh, for that. And that was it. I hope you guys like this video. And uh, until the next time, bye.